The function of the Career Transition Office is to provide a seamless transition from the active component to the reserve component. We provide services to sellers that have a PTS approval or an ECTP quota approval. I am Senior Chief Russell. I'm the Lead and Chief Petty Officer at the Career Transition Office. If a seller has a cell res PTS approval, we can then transition them into the reserve component. And all that means is that there's a billet available for them in the reserves. The ECT program allows sailors who have 24 months of active duty to 16 years of active duty to complete the rest of their time in the reserve component. A sailor can find out if a billet is available by having their command career counselor submit a PTS cell risk quota for them in fleet ride. The best time for a sailor to contact the CTO office is when he or she receives his PTS cell risk quota approval or his or her ECTP approval quota. If a sailor is deployed, we can still work with them. A seller needs to contact the Career Transition Office so that we can provide a seamless transition. Before, it used to take approximately six months to transition to the Naval Reserve. Now we can do it in about 10 days. When an enlisted seller contacts the CTO office, he or she will be assigned a transition assistant. If the transition assistant is not available, anyone from the CTO office can provide world-class customer service to that seller. The TAMP benefit provides an enlisted sailor and their family medical and dental coverage for up to six months after transitioning out of the active component. As long as the enlisted sailor transition directly from the active component to the reserve component, the CTO office will process all of their paperwork so that they can have their TAMP benefits. If a sailor transitioned directly into the reserve component, they can be eligible for up to two years of mobilization deferment. If an enlisted sailor is thinking about leaving active duty, I would give them information about the Naval Reserve, but I would also refer them to NavyReserve.com. Thank you for watching this Navy webcast. If you have any questions, visit NavyReserve.com, npc.navy.mil, or find us on Facebook.